advice and opinions expressed by Dr. Grant Pichet and her guests are meant solely as suggestion and should not be in any way construed as child-specific advice. Dr. Doreen Grant Pichet is the Dr. Doreen of the next week. Doreen Grant Pichet. Dr. Grant Pichet. Dr. Doreen Grant Pichet. Dr. Doreen Grant Pichet is a visionary in the field of autism. Now you can ask the questions on Ask Dr. Doreen. Uh, Lucy says, what great programs have you seen for kids who have graduated from ABA at seven or eight years old? What kind of social skills uh, groups have you seen that are good? Also, what social skills opportunities do you recommend for these kids? And I certainly have a lot to say, but I want to hear from you. Yeah, so Lucy, I'm so glad that you said this, actually, because um, I'm, you know, as our viewers know, I'm just four months back uh, running CARD. We just purchased CARD four months ago. And this is a big one for me. I am, one of the big ones actually is that we, um, they, the previous management shut down our adult centers and I'm gonna be working on that. We actually now have realized that we have um, over 500 individuals who are over the age of 13 at CARD, which is a lot of individuals. So we're working on an adolescent adult program again. But this one, social skills, is something I wanna bring back ASAP, like in the next few months. And I want to start providing it in group format at all of our clinics. That's my goal. And I just said it, so I'm glad I said it. Now there the you universe, go. Now the universe the will help me make it happen. So I think that especially today, and Lucy, I'm glad the way you wrote it, because especially in this day and age where insurance companies are cutting kids off at age eight, no matter what their continued needs might be, um, I feel very strongly that we need to have groups available for our children, um, social skills groups, generalization groups, like I want to have a variety of different groups available, and I think that if you find a good social skills group, it's fantastic, as long as you make sure that the children are kind of within, I mean, not, they don't have to be identical in their skill set, but you never, you know, you want to make sure they're approximately the same age range. Uh, that you don't have cha a lot of challenging behaviors, kind of the same thing as, as, as going to class, right? If you have one child in a classroom who has a very severe challenging behavior, it detracts from everyone else because the teacher has to pay more attention to them. It also provides a, a poor model. So you want to just make sure that there are certain appropriate parameters, but I love the idea of social skills groups. Don't forget, you can watch Ask Dr. Doreen live every Tuesday morning at 10 a.m. Pacific time. We hope to see you there.